It has been said that, at its best, preservation engages the past in a conversation with the present over a mutual concern for the future. Bayer Blinder Bell Architects and Planners was founded as a counterpoint to urban renewal and has become a world leader in architecture and planning based on the firm's deep understanding of and commitment to New York's history as reflected in patterns of settlement and land use. The main building at Ellis Island held the promise of a new life for more than 12 million immigrants to New York. The hallways that once rang with dozens of languages fell silent in the 1950s and by the 1980s required significant restoration and renovation. Bayer Blinder Bell worked very closely with the National Park Service and the New York State Historic Preservation Office to conserve original materials and architectural features in copper, brick, limestone, tile, metalwork, and plaster. The firm's meticulous research and analysis has resulted in a masterfully restored main building at Ellis Island, where the immense registry room now welcomes some two million visitors annually. On the other side of the Atlantic, the firm is helping to tell the story of those who left their homelands for life in a new world. The Red Star Line Museum of Migration in Antwerp, Belgium is set to open in 2012. When it does, visitors will be able to walk in the footsteps of millions of Eastern Europeans who fled oppression in the late 18th and early 19th centuries. Many of the immigrants to the United States came seeking work on the railroads and canals that were beginning to knit this vast new country together. It is altogether fitting then that Bayer Blinder Bell had a major role in completing the New York State Canal Recreation Way plan. The plan presented a new vision of the Empire State's historic canal system as a linear park, taking advantage of the region's heritage, preserving the beauty of its natural settings, and undertaking recreational improvements to foster economic development. In an area as built up as New York City, one must think creatively to provide open space and recreational opportunities. Long overlooked and underutilized, Governor's Island enjoys a prime position as an island set apart from the intensity of use in the surrounding boroughs. Together with the Preservation League and other members of the Governor's Island Alliance, Bayer Blinder Bell worked to document and study the historic and open space resources of the island and to evaluate alternative future uses. From these major sites to the iconic buildings so integral to the New York experience, the Chrysler Building, Grand Central Terminal, the Empire State Building Lobby, the Beacon Theater, Bayer Blinder Bell continues to practice award-winning stewardship of historic buildings in sensitive urban sites. Their work sets a high standard around the country and around the world. Whether retrofitting old buildings for new uses or building state-of-the-art structures with a profound respect for the social history of the surrounding communities, Bayer Blinder Bell successfully applies classical principles to a new generation of design and planning and, as William Shakespeare said, makes us heirs of all eternity. For these reasons and many more, we are delighted to honor Bayer Blinder Bell as a pillar of New York. <laughs>